Brisbane retiree Robin Clarsen charges his car during the day. Starting at about 9 o'clock in the morning on a lovely spring day like today, the uh, solar generation is supplying the household use as well as charging one car. By midday, it can charge both cars. That's when his rooftop solar is pumping out the power. As we get more and more of our electricity coming from the sun, we're going to want to shift people's charging towards the middle of the day when we have watts of electricity available. The University of Queensland's found that most people plug their cars in at night. But researchers want to find ways of switching people to charging during the day. It's about uh, charging at a time that won't stress the grid and using the resources when they are abundant. Robin Clarsen thinks more charging options would be needed. For example, if uh, employers can provide solar power at their workplace, then uh, EV owners can drive to their workplaces and still charge their cars during the day. Like any new technology, uh, the electricity grid needs to expand and change and there's, this is one, no doubt that this is a massive uh, period of, of transformation. It's even predicted that cars could be used to power homes and the grid. That's the goal, that we can use these electric vehicles as batteries on wheels to bring down the costs of the transition. I would love to do that, charge during the day and use it at night. George Roberts, ABC News, Brisbane.